All right, we're looking at our RGB light strip. This is a 60 LED per meter strip, so a little bit closer together uh, spacing on this strip. So you have a total of 300 LEDs per the spool. This so you can see this a little bit. So have a weather coating on them. This is the black background. They do come with a standard uh, connector clip here. I've got them snugged into our basic plug and play controller. Two extra wires for easy power injection. So if you're running longer runs, you can inject power into these so uh, you prevent uh, voltage drop. These are clearly marked so you can cut these to different lengths. And the uh, chip is for every three LEDs. So every three LEDs on these are controllable. This is WS2811 Smart RGB. So when you are controlling each pixel, every three LEDs is, is considered a pixel on these. So you have 300 LEDs, so you'd have 100 pixels on this 5 meter spool uh, to control with. This spool on the other end also has the clip already built in, so you can easily hook these end to end. Again, the extra wires if you need to inject more power if you're on a multiple uh, spools end to end. Got these hooked up to our smart plug and play controller. I'm just going to run through some modes here real quick so you can kind of take a look. So if you needed something a little bit more dense lighting than uh, traditional, uh, a lot of folks are using the 30 uh, LED per meter strips. This is obviously just twice as dense because they're 60. Run through a couple modes here so you can kind of get the hang of what they look like. I'll do some solid reds. Solid blue, solid green, and the white. So again, these are our 60 LED per meter, five meter spool of smart RGB strip lights.